Sometime in 3ds Max, you work with snap toggle and angle snap by using keyboard shortcuts like S and A. And then by mistake you hit D key so that particular viewport showed disable label. So in this video I will talk about what is the use of disable viewport. First I create a teapot object in my perspective viewport. Then I switch to front viewport and then press D key to disable that particular viewport. You can also disable active viewport by manual method. So click on plus sign and choose disable viewport. Now I create some other object in my perspective viewport. So these changes update in remaining viewports. But front viewport is disabled so these changes not update in this particular viewport. But if you click on this viewport these changes will update quickly. If you learned something in this video please like this video and subscribe my channel for more tips and tricks videos. Thanks for watching.